Hello guys, welcome back to another video, and today we are going to be looking at another budget deck. Now, I'm moving over to Omega because Dueling Book sucks, and uh, they are using, just to explain this over here, uh, a um, card market. And card market is terrible, um, If you, unless you live in, I guess, the UK. Maybe the shipping is better there, but um, yes, uh, they're like including a, a bunch of stuff like uh, shipping. They're also the card market prices for commons are terrible. Like this card is ten cents in card market and one cent in a, a TCG player, for example. So that's why it shows up at twenty. This deck is ten dollars, and um, for ten dollars, I think you're getting just an insane value. And I think it's important to show y'all. So here we go. Let's. Talk about the deck. Um, Generator is what I've uh, brought to you all guys today. This is a kind. This is pretty much a control deck. Um, it focuses on making rank nines and going into the boss monsters that will kind of uh, generate you advantage along with putting up interruptions. Uh, let's do the card by card. Uh, first, we're playing Two Har. Uh, this is the main boss monster that's not from the extra deck. Essentially, it's just an Omni Negate. You can tribute two tokens summoned by boss stage. First, second, we have Vala. Um, Vala can summon itself from hand by pitching a generator, and then uh, you can, I believe, target a generator in your uh, grave and summon it. Um, hold on. Uh, once per turn, target your hand, you can send another generator from hand to grave. Uh, summon this card from banish it when it leaves the field, and it's a special summon. You can target a generator. You can special summon a generator from your hand or grave. So essentially, you can activate Vala, pitch any of the bosses, summon itself, then Vala, summon one of the bosses from Grave, make um, uh, Leviathan. But um, essentially, that's what... Uh, that does, that, yeah, essentially, it's just a one-card rank nine. One Mardell, uh, we're only on one Mardell because it's kind of weird to draw, but you're also on uh, the three Lone Fires to summon it from deck. Uh, and then on summon, Mardell searches a generator card or a plant monster from deck to hand. So essentially, what the, so yeah, essentially this card just um, on summon searches a plant from a deck, or sorry, a generator from deck to hand. So you can add your boss stage with this. You can search your Vala if you need to. Playing uh, one Utgarda, this is kind of, this is another boss monster you're able to play. Uh, instead of the Omni Negate from Har, it's the, it's, it is it's a Banish. Um, uh, essentially, you can tribute two generator monsters. All of them do that, by the way, and the monsters are supposed to be the tokens you summon off boss stage. And then target card on the field, Banish it. Then Hela, um, you can tribute one generator monster, and then target a generator or zombie in grave with a different name than the tributed monster, and summon it. So essentially, you can go Wahala, tribute a token, summon one of the boss monsters for their interruption effects, either the Garda, the Har, or the Mardell for advantage. Playing three Planet Pathfinder, this is to search generator boss stage. Nothing else. I will go over boss stage more when we get there. Three Lone Fire Blossom, this is for Mardell, and Mardell is usually used for searching boss stage. One boss quest. This is actually the search target off Mardell. Essentially, you can reveal a generator in hand and then search two generator spell traps with different names from deck to hand, except boss quest. So essentially what you can do here is you can search a, a boss fight and a boss stage. Again, we'll talk about the boss stage and the, the other cards when we get to them. Three Xtrav. Uh, it's a cheap deck, so you gotta play Xtrav. Um, and the deck doesn't isn't super reliant on any of its extra deck cards other than uh, Leviathan. Uh, and even if uh, you are, even if Le Leviathan is great, obviously, but, you know, you could just play, like, Generator existed before Leviathan released, so you could play, um, you could play the, uh, just, like, Control with Har and uh, Garda. Triple Boss Stage, uh, when your opponent draws a card, you can summon a, you can summon four uh, Generator Tokens, or uh, Generator Tokens, wait, hold up, let me... What the fuck? I misread this card. Hold on. I can't seem to. <laughs> this is crazy. Uh, if a card is added from the main deck to your opponent's hand, you can special summon generator monster from deck, and then if you special summon a generator monster your, uh, during your opponent's turn, uh, you can summon as many tokens as you possibly can. Essentially, this is going to give you access to uh, two uh, triggers of the generator uh, mo boss monster's effects. So if you have, say, an Utgarda and a Har, you have a Banish and an Omni. Uh, if you have, let's say, a Leviathan 
uh, you can, I believe, uh, uh, you can tribute this season. God damn it. Tribute this season card from the, uh, and then attach cards from Foot the Grave to the Seven Monster. A non fairy generator sees. And then attach. Um, yeah, no. So essentially, uh, with uh, Leviathan, I'm saying Leviathan because of a Valorant team the team's name. Um, all your monsters lose a hundred, a thousand attack and defense. Strip is good. Um, monster material. Uh, you can attach cards from the field, any field and graveyard to the monster material. Ever the monsters materials this card had. Uh, essentially, here this is almost like a board breaker. Um, uh, you can uh, attach stuff on your turn, but you can also do it on your opponent's turn for disruption. I just went over Leviathan there, not for no real reason. But yes, no, boss stage is core to the deck for disruption. Triple Fog Gate Trap Hole, uh, just treat cheap uh, back row, uh, makes the deck just as cheap as it can possibly be. We'll just go over that stuff here. Three Grave Diggers for the same reason, it's also good against Shifter. Uh, three Torrential Tribute for the same reason, it's just cheap back row, and then three Solemn Strike for the same reason. We're playing three boss fight for um, searching the uh, generous, the uh, field spell. Uh, and then we're playing three metaverse for the same reason. Uh, and then one boss room uh, because uh, it's almost in a gate. And if you already have, if you like have like boss quest plus boss stage, I mean, you know, you're going to want to search something that's going to get you value. For the Astro Deck, we're playing three uh, Sacred Tree Beasts. Uh, this is a negate in some situations, which, and it can also like benefit, it, it can also sometimes be better than, than Leviathan. Uh, three uh, Fufu, you can, uh, with a certain amount of, of like uh, gates, you can do things, but what you're really looking for here is you can detach a material from this card, then target an effect monster, uh, uh, and a one that you control, target both and negate them. Just another good card to have in the extra. Already explained Leviathan, uh, not three nine lives cat. Uh, it can occasionally get you back like a Hella, and then use Hella to get back like Fala and like Spiral with some advantage or Mardell rather. And then uh, three uh, Jormungandr, uh, That this is a target for Levi Leviathan. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you guys next time. Goodbye.